It was this empire that bothered our other great belligerent, Sparta. Yet, Sparta had very little to do with actually starting the war. It was Sparta's ally, Corinth, who wanted to stop Athens the most. They knew that if Athens wasn't stopped soon, they'd conquer all of Greece. But, unfortunately for Corinth, the Spartans weren't nearly as imaginative, and always slow to act. So it would take an extreme Athenian provocation to convince Sparta to go to war. Lucky for Corinth, they wouldn't have to wait too long, because on the island of Corcyra, there was just such a provocation. Behind Athens, the islanders of Corcyra had the second largest fleet in Greece. This meant that the seagoing Athenians were eager to have them as allies. One day, the Corcyrians found themselves in a dispute with Corinth, and appealed to Athens for help. Seeing this as a chance to make friends, the Athenians sent ships to help Corcyra, and together they defeated Corinth. The conflict only escalated from there. Eventually, Corinth had enough evidence to convince the Spartans that it was time for war. And so in 432 BC, Sparta and her allies voted to go to war with Athens, and her entire empire. You didn't have to cut me off. Like me.